we want to focus on cat preparation and then discuss this what are some of the areas which have high weightage in cat in quant uh, the elephant in the room is arithmetic which is ratios mixtures speed time races percentages profit and loss simple interest compound interest some aspects of averages basic equation solving linear equation pipes and cisterns work time little bit of progressions all of these a give or take half the paper is this a telephone to the room beyond this move to algebra uh, so be, move to geometry geometry i mean geometry trigonometry mensuration coordinate geometry so the the first simpler topic will account to half of then the geometry and allied topics will account for uh, give or take one fourth or little more than that then go to algebra then go to number theory permutation combination all of that if you get the basic arithmetic topics and geometry in the bag then out of 34 you are covering give or take 22 23 questions probably even more depending on which year it is and so maybe 24 25 questions so you've got the entire paper covered if you cover basic topics and geometry and allied topics that should be the first one dlr is more of a mixed bag solve lots and lots of puzzles from new templates but you can't really categorize dlr for verbal reading is the ball game read get on to barat's reading list if you're not already on it get on to it today now find find where that list is how you get on to the telegram group or facebook group or or youtube community page or wherever he posts it that's a that's a pot of gold find the url where he has put all his articles in so put barat's reading list and 2 im you'll find that page there are about 400 curated articles of extremely high quality with some blurb written about them categorized by subject and topic find the, the, that's a gold mine so hit that and read reading is not the most important thing it's practically the only thing read for an hour every day vrc will take care of itself you won't really have to take care of that how can i develop skills to solve dlr questions find so dlr questions are the, are challenging and so do lots and lots of puzzles a wonderful starting point is cat 2017 18 19 papers almost all these questions have detailed video solutions check those out online you can find the question papers online so try those read that um the, the 2im has a wonderful dlr package with a variety of puzzles and so these days it's not the game is not about solving a few charts and a few arrangement puzzles and all that it's about learning new templates figuring out a way to think so focus on doing new templates focus on being creative and thinking about the best constraint to start over go through the solutions to get into the head of the guy who set the problem the guys who crack it i found some impossibly tough dlr questions which i i know that i would have taken minimum 24 minutes to solve and then i realized that i'm missing something major because i know there are five guys who crawled solved that in 11 minutes they are not doing what i am doing better they doing something else so i keep on practicing then i get better and better at what i am doing but in dlr maybe the game is to think differently to break the rule book and figure out from something else so maybe they are looking at answer choices maybe they are looking at the questions maybe they are taking a punt and and going with it maybe they are taking more risk than i do maybe they have built up their intuitive part of their brain where suddenly they feel like look ram should have taken the knife and is sitting in the dining room something is telling them that that because they have done so many puzzles like that so uh, you need to break some rules and, and redraw them so do that otherwise what you can do generally become more curious about puzzle solving go to mathematical puzzles solve them solve sudoku puzzles left right and center because this is stamina linked we should be able to pick up a sudoku link book and say one hour i'm going bang 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 trying as much as possible your mind has to get conditioned to seeing puzzle after puzzle after puzzle so do that and next one is on mocks should i start solving mocks right now uh, get a feel for mocks make sure that you're ready uh, for mocks so my suggestion would be the mock season really starts second half of june onwards but uh, you should look to do a mock every 3 weeks or every month now so that you just get to know what it is maybe you're not fully prepared but give it a go it's a 3 hour exam building a 3 hour stamina takes time don't wait to finish syllabus and waiting syllabus for waiting to finish syllabus is just an excuse it's a gigantic excuse fabulous delightful uh, enjoyable fun pleasant excuse but an excuse nevertheless if you think about it there is no such thing as finishing syllabus for dilr that is 32 questions you can attempt today out of the 34 in quant you go and take it you can attempt to 10 to 12 34 questions in vrc you can attempt everything so somebody who's not prepared for cat out of the 100 he or she technically can look at 75 questions तो और कितना चाहिए 
so this whole prepare waiting to finish syllabus is a story you're telling yourself don't wait to finish syllabus there's no such thing and when should a repeater start taking mocks or some you know the game you know the drill you've got a percentile you've taken the exam so start early your preparation is going to be completely or predominantly driven by mocks fill fundamental gaps but you know probably what your strength and weaknesses are suppose you're saying look i took cat 2019 i got 98 in um, uh, in quant and i got 91 in dilr and i got 53 in vrc then you know you should take mocks and you should read 10 books right so, so that's your game so i'm going to read articles and books left right and center to boost up my reading game and then i'm going to take mocks so that's your plan keep filling funda gaps in quant and dilr but uh, book reading vrc is your gap to fill it's your big gap so focus on that and book filling vrc is your gap area and mocks is going to be your revision area so keep doing that